the hell? I mean, bro, this man, man, this, this, it was a hard watch, man. All right, Dharma. I do. I didn't want to talk about this freaking film, man. No, sorry. I didn't want to talk about this, this TV show or whatsoever. So again, spoilers, 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 spoilers. If you haven't seen this, I'm going to spoil this for you. So either you know the real story or you've seen the TV show. I'm going to spoil it. Here we go. So I knew nothing about what this guy did. All I knew was the name, the name, the name. So I was like, you know what? Let me watch this thing knowing nothing. If I knew about this whole story, I wouldn't have watched the TV show because there are now reports that the victims are not happy by how this is depicted because they don't want to live through this. If I knew about this real story, hey, why are you making a TV show about this stuff? Like, I, for what reason? Like, when I when you hear about this stuff, like, what? Like, there were times when I was watching this and I was like, there's no way he did this. There's no way he did... Like, when he... Like, bro, what the... This guy was cooking a heart. He ate someone's heart. Like, when I saw this, I was like, wait, what is this? Because the worst thing was, if this was fiction, it'd be like, oh, wow, that's bad. But what made it so uncomfortable was, was, I, was I was thinking to myself, that way, did, is this real? And I was like, it has to be real because there is no way you'd be so insensitive to just um, over-dramatize parts, parts of this thing. So I was like, wait, this is real. I'm like, this guy, he had, he was carrying a severed head in a box. And you're chopping up people in bits and so forth. And you're keeping... Unless you guys can tell me. Unless you guys can tell me. Because I, I don't go on the nest looking at stuff that serial killers do. I have never in my life had anything as messed up as this in my life. Never. I was like, this is not... This, this, this is the most messed up individual I've ever seen. And a guy like this, you either lock away in a, in a dungeon or you have to burn him. You, have two, you only have two choices. Either you burn him, so there's there's nothing left to this freaking dude, or you lock him up in a freaking dungeon because he can't be saved. Because I watched the interview of the real guy, the, the real interview of, of the actual Dharma, and I was like, bro, when you just see, look, how nonchalant he's about the whole thing, and just how it's about, well, you know, like, yeah, and I, and I just have this impulse, and I can't, I'm like, okay, you're dealing with a very scary dude. You're dealing with a very scary dude. And I think, obviously, what made it a bit personal was that, you know, it's black people. So, like, damn. so he's mainly targeting black homosexuals. So how just took away the lives of all these black people. I was like, yeah, man. I mean, this this guy's this... Like, a piece of crap isn't enough to talk about the dude. Like, this guy, he's the, the lowest thing ever, I can ever think of, you know. Um, but see, and I even, I even feel weird complimenting the actors. Because they did do a good job technically. Technically, they did a good job. But I actually feel it's wrong to say, oh my gosh, the acting was so good. And Because I can't say that because this really happened. People really died. And there are families who you didn't even, you couldn't have a body because this, this filthy, disgusting cretin chopped people up in bits. The hell? I mean, bro, this man, nah, man, this, this, it was a hard watch, man. It was a hard watch. It was a hard watch, bro. Like I was like, this is this this is just this is just so bad. So, like again, obviously, this is a spoiler thing. So obviously, if you've watched this, you've you've seen this. But if you've someone since it, if you if you're watching this spoiler and you want to watch it, all right, fine. Because my friends said that yo, I heard about this stuff. I'm not really feeling. It's okay. Look, if you're feeling a bit iffy about wanting to watch it, don't watch it because it's disgusting. It's disgusting because what makes it... That's the whole point. If it was fiction, I'm like, okay, look, it's fiction. Like, bro, I watch Rambo movies and all that kind of stuff. What made it so uncomfortable and hard to watch was like, oh my God, this is basically a true story. Oh my God, this is basically a true story. Oh my God, this is basically a true story. Oh my God, this is basically a true story. So at every... When he was just doing all the stuff, I was like, wait, did he really do this? Did he really do this? Because when it's real, it's like, oh God, this is like... This is, un this is uncomfortable. And it was a very uncomfortable watch. And bro... It that whoever that guy in the inmates who basically killed him messed up. As if what people said, look at how poetic it is. His first victim, he killed with like gym equipment, and what kills him? A guy with gym equipment. That is what you call poetry. That is poetry, man. But um, 
Yeah, man. Um, a very, 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 I mean, messed up thing. But I do think, though, that you should have spoken to the victims. The fact that the victims... I'm just thinking about just the stuff that this guy did. Like, the like the 14-year-old and so... You don't know. Because what was annoying me was the lady. I think it was... I've got what the, what the actress's name is. Nisi something. Really? She did it really... I mean, I did it. But my thing is, she was like, yo... This is a 14-year-old kid. Aren't you... He's a kid, but although he's an adult. And the amount of times that, the, that these guys went to the police and the police didn't, they, they didn't do anything, I'm like, man. Because I watched the um, witness thing of the guy who got away. I think it's... Is it Tracy Adams? Who, who got away? Imagine if he didn't get away. Imagine if that guy didn't get away. Because that guy's a hero. Like, if he doesn't get away, he continues. He can't... Like, he would... There was no stopping him. He would have continued. So... Imagine if he didn't get away. And you know what was crazy? See, again, I don't know whether how true it was. That's why I'm funny about this whole Netflix series. Did people really send him those letters and so forth? Saying, well, you're amazing. So, I mean, this one, this one, people are listen, listen, man. Or you poor people. I don't know. I said again, man. It was messed up. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. This is messed up, man. It's messed up. 